guys welcome back to my channel today is going to be a sale video these are all kind of end of the year clear out stuff I've either had listed for a while on eBay and hasn't sold new stuff that I have recently decided to sell um, I have a whole assortment of things and rather than go through prices in the video what I'm going to do is put the prices for each item in the description box below. So if you see it in this video, you're interested and you wanna know if it's even in your budget, um, go check the description box before you contact me. Um, once you contact me, you can do that via email, it's probably the easiest, and my email address is also in the description box. I can send you still pictures if you want, um, and then everything will be done through PayPal invoice. Um, so the prices that I put in the description box below will include um, I think all shipping fees everything um, I can only ship in the United States I can ship internationally but just understand it's expensive and I'm not going to cover the additional cost to ship internationally if you'd like me to ship you something I can do that but you will have to cover the additional cost for me to get it to you so let me take you through everything that I have as quickly as possible. And then you guys can, like I said, contact me to ask questions. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna show you a quick shot here of everything that I have for sale. So you can decide if you wanna keep watching or not. Um, I'm gonna start at the top and work my way down. Um, so up here we have my Rebecca Minkoff Mini Mac, and this is in purple nubuck leather with silver hardware. I would say it's in excellent used condition. Um, Coach Bowery crossbody, and that is in the color chalk. It's patent leather, and it has a floral print on it, and that's new with tags. Then next to that, we have a Louis Vuitton Mahino Solar PM, and it's in a blue color that I believe is called CL. And I would say it's in good used condition. It does have some white marks and some scuffs on it. Next shelf down, we have a dark turquoise Rogue 25 in, uh, with prairie rivets. And don't worry, this isn't my personal one. This is one that I picked up at the outlet for a friend who decided she did not want it. And I did not get the best deal on it. So it may just be something that I need to return, but I want to offer it just in case. Two coach saddle bags. One is in the color peony and the other is in hair calf that's printed with a floral pattern. These are both the saddle 23 size, so I think that is the larger size saddle bag. Then we have a bunch of little crossbodies that did not work with my plus size smartphone. Now, if you have a plus size smartphone, these may work for you. I have a giant case on mine that's rubber, so it makes going in and out of tight pockets really hard. And it did fit in all of these, just it was kind of hard to get in and out and it was annoying me. So we have a Michael Kors Mott crossbody and that is in like a pink and ivory um, color block scheme. We have a Coach Page in melon with prairie rivets. Um, a Michael Kors Ava, an extra small size in maroon. And a Michael Kors Mott crossbody in racing green color block and any of these that don't sell I'm going to be returning so they will not be sale be for sale for very long probably just like the next 30 days and then I'm going to return them next up we have my coach rogue tote and that is in the color chalk with the link and snake skin detail on the side I've gotten a lot of inquiries about this bag people wanting to purchase it um, it's a very expensive bag. I believe the retail price on it is $1,200. So just know that going into it. No, I cannot sell it to you for $150. I just can't do that. I paid way more for it than that. So um, if you're interested, I know it's beautiful, but please check the price in the description box. I have a Coach Bandit 39, and this is in, oh, all of these are new, new with tags. All of these, new with tags, new with tags, new with tags. Um, this one is in, Excellent use condition. I used it probably five times. It is the Coach Bandit 39 in Oxblood. Um, then down here we have my Vince, not Vince, Vince Camuto. What am I talking about? This is a Marco Avane Hobo. It is all woven dark brown leather. It's vintage. Um, so this will probably be one of the cheapest items up here since it's not really a designer item. Um, then I have a Dooney and Burke Disney Pixar. Um, annual pass holder bag that I purchased because I thought my kids would get a kick out of it and they really don't give a 
crap about it. So <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and sell it since they don't seem to care. And then we have a Rogue 30 in Heather Gray with the stud detail. Both of these two are new with tags. This one clearly not because it's vintage. Um, up here we have a Coach Bandit 39 in steel blue. Also excellent use condition. Has a couple very small marks on the inner bag I can send you pictures of. Then a little wristlet pouch with the prairie rivets on it um, in the heather gray color with the suede front. Um, just a wrist, wristlet, um, no crossbody strap on this one. Next shelf down is two Michael Kors bags. These are both from the Aria collection. Um, and I've had these for sale on eBay for quite some time. So also if you see something here you like, check the link in my description box to see if I already have it on eBay. And just know if you contact me directly through email and we do it through pay PayPal invoice rather than eBay, I can give you a discount. So um, these are both on eBay currently. One of them is saddle brown, the other is black, and they both have a crossbody strap option and they are both new with tags. Next, I have my Dooney & Burke Vintage Flower Pot Bag. Very rare bag. If you collect these, please contact me. I love this bag. I just don't use it as much as I should. And this is um, the, whatever you call the yellow color. Gosh, I'm blanking right now. But it is also, I would say, in good use condition. Once again, it's vintage, so it's not perfect. I have a brand new Coach Corn Flower wallet cornflower smooth glove tan leather it has a small spot on the back came that way from the outlet here is the light here is my soho crossbody in primrose with the t rose strap so this is one of the special ones that has the t roses on the strap it's really cute next i have my um, louis vuitton beverly clutch let's say this is in fair used condition it definitely has some issues, so if you're interested, um, I, would, I would love to send you detailed still pictures of it. Next we have my Dooney and Burke Super Rare Togo Bag in the white and natural combination. Really nice condition on this one, I would call it good. There's a couple of spots on the back, but overall it's really excellent and the trim is really gorgeous on it. And a bunch of long shops. So I have the small size satchel with the longer strap that goes with it. Um, these are all brand new, by the way. Um, so that one's the smaller size with the strap. These are all tote ones with tote handles. This is a large, and then this is a small or medium, a medium, I believe, on this one. And this is a another large. So, um, in the description box when I list price, I'm just gonna describe them rather than put the real names because the real names are kind of complicated. So I'll just say like polka dot, oops, sorry. I'm just gonna put these on the floor. They're not cooperating. Polka dot, red geometric, um, you know, etc. Just to make it a little bit easier. I just found two more bags that I forgot that I had because they belong to my friend Sue, the purse fairy. And it they are both new with tags. This is a strawberry pebbled leather Chelsea um, and it has a matching wallet inside that's also brand new. And I also have a suede um, medium size satchel in the color wine. So if you guys are interested in either of these, please contact me. I'll put prices for them also in the description box, but just know if I sell them, it will be on her behalf and I'll be passing all the money along to her. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, if there's something here that you like, look in the description box below for the price. And then if it sounds reasonable to you, please feel free to contact me via email or even Instagram would work. Once things are sold, um, I will put in the description box next to it that it's sold. So you'll see that in caps rather than the price. And it's definitely first come, first serve. I'm not gonna do any layaway or payment plans on these. And, um, if you guys need still pictures or have questions about condition, please feel free to email me about that as well. All right, guys, I will catch you on my next video. Bye.